All right, here's a cool question. A large square of 84 square units. This square is divided into four squares. The bottom right square, which is this square here, is again divided into four squares. This is repeated infinitely many times. What's the yellow area? Let's observe the large square carefully. If the large square has an area of a, then this first yellow square has an area of a by 4. This second yellow square is 1 fourth of a by 4, so its area will be a by 16. This third yellow square will have an area that's 1 fourth of a by 16, so this will be a by 64 and so on. So the total area of the yellow squares will be a by 4 plus a by 16 plus a by 64 and so on, an infinite geometrical progression and it's very easy to find the total area. But here's a far more elegant way. The first yellow square is one third in area of this L-shaped region. The second yellow square is one third in area of this L-shaped region. The third yellow square is one third in area of this L-shaped region and so on. So the sum of all the yellow squares will simply be one third of the sum of all the L-shaped regions. But the sum of all the L-shaped regions is simply the total area of the large square, which is 84. So the sum of the yellow squares will be one third of 84, which is 28. So 28 is our answer.